Okay, so this week's episode and the next few episodes are going to be a little bit different. Um, I'm going to do a series of videos that are essentially a deep dive into what makes me, me. Uh, we're gonna, I'm going to talk a lot about my passions, the things that I love, and the things that I kind of stopped loving over time as well. Um, but I hope going into these videos and, and shooting them and telling these stories will help better accompany these vlogs and kind of give you guys maybe more of an insight of why I'm even doing them. Um, and maybe it'll help me <laughs> realize why I'm doing them as well. So I uh, hope you guys enjoy them. Uh, this week we're starting off with music. Music at one point in time was the most important thing in my life. I'd say for about an eight year period I was so obsessed with music and learning everything I could about it. My musical journey started with late 90s, early 2000s pop punk which was nothing like anything I'd heard before, especially in my family, but it absolutely took control of my life and uh, changed it. I began going to shows and trading CDs and mixes and posters with people to consume it all. Uh, then I started with the drums at 14, then I decided I wanted to write my own songs, and so I taught myself guitar, then bass, and then other instruments to round it all out. Then I started a band in high school, then a band in college, then another band in college, and I was so sure that I'd someday be touring with my band and living the rock star life. Then I graduated college and life happened. I pretty much put everything down and joined the workforce with the thought that I'd get back to music someday, but I never really did. What I loved so much about music were the layers of creative output it provided, from writing melodies to, to lyrics, composing different sounds of different instruments, recording and then performing. And there's no thrill that I experienced like I had with performing live. I still think about the time in my life when music was so important and it's all I wanted to do, and I miss it a lot. But also, I'm trying to remember why it was something that I lost my passion for and it's a confusing thing to try to remember. I know that I was growing up and that life was changing fast, but maybe I just lost my love for it at some point. I hope one day that I can be in a place where I can enjoy that passion and be consumed by that creative process again. But until then, I have a few other things I need to take care of. 